throughout my life, I've seen the importance of people feeling welcome. I've seen it in organizations and I've seen it in societies and I can see it in the world. It's so crucial that we create environments where people feel included, welcomed, wished for and expected. When I see what really makes organizations successful, it's not so much about money. It's more about the, the attitude and the values in the organization. And when they really, you know, meet, greet and treat their customers and colleagues with care and respect and dignity, that's the foundation for a sustainable success in any organization and in any society. Products are made in factories, but brands are made in the minds of people. I think it's almost impossible to create a strong brand without committed people. And a strong brand starts from within through the company culture. And what is company culture? Well, simply put, it's the way we do things around here. So it's about actions and behaviors. So culture isn't about what gets done. It's about how and why we do things. And it's about the people who do it. As a researcher at Karolinska Institute, I focus on compassion and how to develop a compassionate mindset so we can become more authentic. So now the science has shown that that is skills that we can train. I think it's important to, to realize that business and society are interconnected. So the decisions that we make in business will affect our society. The reason why I think that hostmanship has been so well appreciated by more and more organizations is twofold. The first reason is that leaders discover that hostmanship is a very effective way to create cultures where people come first. And the other reason, maybe even more important, is that people working in organizations discover that through hostmanship they become more effective in their relations with their colleagues and with their clients. So hostmanship goes two ways. It's good for the people and it's good for the business. Hostmanship is a practical philosophy in the art of making people feel welcome. It starts with a mindset, your intentions, and then it leads to into a behavior. Because hostmanship is not just some beautiful thoughts, it's words and it's actions that we do to make people feel welcome. 